recording and rolling up and down the fingers. And into the palm. And the pad to the pinky. And the thumb. And down to the wrist. And across the knuckles. And I'm going to leave the ball in the palms, interlace the fingers, and squeeze. And release. Squeeze. Release and squeeze one more time. And release, they will go around the back. Switch. 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 And switch. Hinging at the waist through the legs. Switch. Switch. And switch. And balls on the floor. Assess. How the feet feel. Step on the ball right in the middle of the foot and press down three times. Press down on each of the knuckles. Roll across the knuckles. Bring the ball to the middle of the foot and wiggle the toes. And bring the ball to the crease between the knuckles and the toes and press the toes into the ball. Good morning, John. Raise the toes and separate. Press again. Wiggle again. And scribble. Release, reassess, and repeat on the other foot. Middle of the foot first. Knuggles. Rolling across. Middle foot and wiggle. Press. Separate. Press. <clears throat> wiggle. Scribble. Three, two, one, release. Fall out of the way. Reassess and uh, shake the tree. Three. Two, one, centering, swing the arms. 
posting at the waist. And let's center with some motion wave breathing. Fingers and thumb at the base, the spine, step out, gather in, starlight. And center, gather from the other side. And center. Let's take some steps forward. And then elbow towards the opposite knee. Slap the opposite heel. And slap it behind you. And a cross step with the twist and a punch. And then we're going to walk, march, or jog. And today we're going to do standing leg and core exercises. No rapid squats, if you want to do those. I think I'll sprint myself, but uh, whatever you choose to do, including exactly what you're doing. Just be safe. We got the bands in the after class. Let me get going. In five, four, three, two, one, two. Ten. Twenty. Twenty. 
And hand 30, do a nice deep breaths. Interlace the fingers, bring them up overhead. Reach up. Come on down if you're on your toes and bend back if you can. Otherwise, just reach straight up. Back to center, drop one hand to the side, bend in that direction. Then go the other way. Back to center, interlace the fingers and bring the hand down to the chest, push out. Come on down, one hand on top, one on the bottom. You can use a band or a towel or a cloth if you need to. Pull up as you're pulling down. And then go the other way. Come on back to center and shrug. your fingers on your shoulders and roll your elbows forward. And then backwards. Extend your arms out and tap your shoulders. Keep your arms extended, bring the shoulder blades together and hold. And then give yourself a bear hug. Back out again, squeeze. Bear hug with the other arm on top. Back, squeeze. Original arm on top. And one more time. Back squeeze. And the other arm on top. One hand behind the back, pressing down and in on the elbow. Then the other. Grab both elbows, rock side to side. One hand out, fingers up, pull back. Fingers down. Lock the wrist and keep flopping. And then rotate in one direction. And then the other. Other hand, fingers up. Down. Flopped. Up. 
Rotate. Switch directions. Bring your hands down, rotate the neck. Go the other way. Nod. And go ear to shoulder. Oh, everybody's joining class today. Look up. And look down. Over one shoulder. Then the other. Tuck in your chin and peck like a pigeon. We'll do a side lunge. Go the other way. And come on up and grab a stick for the gym stick routine. Starting with some dynamic swimmers in one direction. And then the other. Bring the stick up overhead and go side to side. Lower waist. Rocking side to side. And bring the stick down to just above the knees, bring the hands around front between the knees, hinging at the waist, pull up. And then bring the stick around front to the middle, hold on near or at the top of the stick, step back, hinge at the waist, Stretch the shoulders and upper body. And come on up, bring the stick across the body with one hand, bring the other one underneath the armpit, grab the shoulder, hinge at the waist, and tug gently. And then bring the stick across the body the other way and repeat. And come on up, bring the stick to the side of the foot. Push out with the top hand, pull in with the bottom as you hinge at the waist. And repeat on the other side.
Bring the stick in front of one foot, your toes about six inches away, drop the stick to the collarbone, slide down with both hands. To increase the stretch, lift the heel of the sole and pivot on the heel. Back and forth. Come on up, same thing on the other side. Come on up, press the sole of the first foot against the stick. And then the other. Bring one leg forward, bend at the knee, other leg. You're on your toes, come on down and stretch the hip flexors. To the other side. And come on up, grab one leg by the shin, ankles, or toes, and stretch the quads. And then the other leg. Bring the first leg up in front, push the knee towards the back, in slightly at the waist. And the same thing with the other leg. And come on up, bring the stick in the middle, hold on with two hands, one hand or a finger or two, step back and up on your toes for 15. And then back on your heels for 15. And back down. If you want, you can hold on to the stick because we're going to do the uh, standing leg and core. You might want to hold on to the stick or the back of a chair, being, uh, put it on your side. But if you feel um, that you don't need anything, let's get started. One, two, four, nine, and ten. Other legs. And now we're going to go backwards. We're going to keep the knee locked. And the other.
And now we go laterally. Other leg. And now some butt kicks. And we're going to do a tap across and back. And the other way. And now uh, some hip rotations only go as high as feels safe. You can hold on to a stick, of course. Other leg. Knee to the same elbow, same side. Other leg. And 10, and then finally, we're going to cross our arms and go to knee to opposite elbow, or you can continue doing what you were just doing if you find this one a little bit too much. And done. Oh, I take a couple of restorative breaths. We're doing ha breathing or hado breathing this week. Nice big deep inhale through the nose diaphragmatically, stomach coming out. And then we're going to exhale through the mouth making the ha sound for a count of 10 or so. And as I've said before, if you're doing this on your own, um, you can exhale uh, for as long as you can. Um, try to make it at least 10, but uh, if you can go 20, that's great, or 12, whatever. We're gonna do five rounds, here we go.
and rubbing the hands together. Wanichi ball. Letting it dance us around. And centering with two breaths. And let's open our hearts. Pausing, exhaling, and sending it out. And centering two breaths. And bringing down Chi from above. And scooping up from below. <laughs> Thanks, Tom. You're welcome, Mira. Mira, take care. You too. Stay dry. Thank you, Tom. Okay, Bill. Good to see you. Take care. Thanks, Tom. Art, good to see you. And uh, Richard, Jonathan, Ava, we can do some bands. Let's grab them. Switch the camera. Let's um, put the pan in the palm of one hand. Go across to the other shoulder. Insert the other hand and come down with the tricep extension. Oh, good, Bill. And then we go to the other shoulder and reverse. And then back to the first. Uh, let's go to the hip on the first. And we'll do some bicep curls across the body diagonally.
Any other way? And then we're going to get down on the ground. I think you, I'll leave the camera there. You'll be able to see me. Let's wrap the bands around the feet. Like so. And we're going to do some bicycles. And then bring the band up to the knees. Above the knees. We'll go on one side. You're in the way there, you know. And do some clamshells. And turn on that side and then turn on the other. All right, and then we're going to go on our backs, keep the bands around the knees. Uh, hands are by the side. We're going to do a bridge. We'll do 10 bridges, and on the 10th one, we're going to hold for the count of 10. We go up, one, two, and down. Up, one, two, and down. That's three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten. Hold ten. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, and down. And now get up. And we're going to bring the bands down to the ankles. And we're going to do some uh, lateral moves first by getting into athletic position, hinging at the waist. Step to the side and back. Two, one, two, 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 one, two, one, two, one, two, one, and two. And then we'll I'm going to grab my lighter band again for the arms and hold it out in front, come out, one, two, and in.
four, five, eight, nine, and 10. And then the same thing behind the back. One, two, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, that'll do it. Check it out.